Hello there. So let me quickly show you how Tiny PNG works. So here's the website that I'm talking about. Type in your URL um, search bar, tinypng.com, and this is what it would look like. So now what we do is we go and we find ourselves a photograph. This one of mine over here is 3.39 megabytes. Um, keep in mind that you can upload to a max of five megabytes each up to 20 images. That's quite a bit. But also the more you the, the bigger the image and the more of them that you upload, the slower your system will be. So just keep that in mind. So all you do is you take your image, pick it up with your mouse, and simply drag it and drop it over there. So tiny PNG now is taking that 3.6 megs image and it's compressing it. As you can see, it is busy working and it should be finished working any moment now. It's nearly there. It's still thinking about it. So now imagine you have 20 images up to five megs each. That's massive. So there you have it. My 3.6 megs image has been down um, compressed down to 470.4 kilobytes. That's a saving of 87% of space. If I had shared this image in its size on any of my um, newsletters or on my website or wherever, it would have loaded slowly, incredibly slow for that matter. But with Tiny and PNG, it works so much better. If for whatever reason, this is still too large for you, simply download it and then re-upload it as many times as you need. You can get these three figures over here down to two. Keep in mind, once again, that you will lose um, clarity and all sorts of things like that, as mentioned previously, when you download it too many times, when you compress it too many times. All right? I hope this is helpful. All the best.